Good morning, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, welcome to the show. We are getting her going here this early morning. Let's see, we got 4.09 in the morning AM right now. And uh, yeah, this, this place is not even packed yet. There's uh, still a bunch of spots open yet. So, oh, that's a nice Peterbilt looking uh, there at the uh, end of the parking uh, or at the end of the row right there. But yeah, it is looking like a beautiful day today again. At least it's not raining as of yet. They were saying it's supposed to be raining later today, but uh, yeah, so we can expect to be driving in rain later today, guys. We really can. Now you guys will help me watch out for them deers out there today, will you? At least, uh, you know, that's my wishes. <clears throat> we don't need to hit another one this week. But anyhow, we are having a good morning. I am pretty happy today we'll be... Uh, should make it home no problem as long as we don't uh, run into any deers. <laughs> we did pretty good yesterday. We did a thousand and thirty seven kilometers. That's pretty good. That's probably about 620, 630 miles roughly. So that was a, it was a good day worth of driving yesterday. We still had about 27 minutes Turn remaining. Left on East Main Street. East CR Main 46. Street. All right, all right. <laughs> Let's see here. Yeah. We got a Love's truck stop over here too. And this is the this is the shop from over here that uh, I had to get the uh, service truck from last week. And I was literally only one mile down the road and it took them two hours to get there. It's like, are you kidding me? But that's how it was. Yeah, it took him a couple of minutes to, to, uh, to, the right on Saint Paul, Minneapolis. to actually change that uh, that hub uh, seal there, right? In 800 feet, take the entrance to the right on Saint Paul, Minneapolis. I know, RJ. That's the way we're going. I know. You're telling me, but I know. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, it's probably getting pretty dark there, so. I'll hang it up and I'll show you guys more once the sun comes up. Just got into Minneapolis early this morning. It is currently quarter to six in the morning. And so far we've been able to dodge all them deers out there this morning. And trust me, I've seen quite a few out there again. I don't know what it is, but they're just south of Minneapolis. There seems to be a lot of deer up in that area. And uh, I've even seen several that had gotten hit very recently too. So yeah, you definitely got to keep an eye out there. That's for sure. I had one that ran up into the road and was almost <laughs> running into me, but he was beside me here on the passenger side and the four-wheeler was right beside me too. And to me, it almost looked like the four-wheeler hit it, but I couldn't quite tell. But the four-wheeler never pulled over and it didn't look like it had any serious damage. But I did see the deer when I was looking in the mirror. I did see it tumbling behind the, the four-wheeler there. So, But I didn't, you know, didn't see it, it actually hitting anything. So I'm not sure if the deer just fell or, or if somebody actually hit it. And I didn't see it uh, running into my trailer. But it, to me it almost looked like... It, it ran into that four-wheeler, but I could be wrong. But anyways, here we are. So far, it's nice, peace, and quiet. I mean, it's Sunday morning. The sun has risen. It's just about to peek over that wall over there. And so, yeah, I figured I'd turn on my cameras again. I don't know. Here, the last couple of days, I I haven't really made much of videos. <laughs> I, I, when I imported my footage this morning, it's like, I only had three clips on my GoPro. It's like, really? I could do better than that. So I need to, you know, kick myself in the ass and get some better videos put up here, you know? I think it's time to pull into this rest area up here and make us our half an hour break. I do believe it is time. We've been going for a little over four hours already. So I think it is time for us to, uh, you know, Take a little bit of a break and uh, 
probably heat something up in the microwave and get us a bite to eat. I'm not really super hungry yet, but I am getting a little bit hungry, but main thing is I got to go use the bathroom for a change and just check the tires and check everything, right? So let's go ahead and do that. Let's see, only one truck in here today, so that's kind of nice. When it's nice and quiet, peaceful in here. Yeah, I saw a truck driver here a while back ago when I was parked in here for half an hour break. He comes in here, he pulls in right in the middle here somewhere, and you can see how far the building is. It's not that far, right? And he gets out and he pisses right beside his truck. I'm like, really, dude? The restroom, uh, you know, he could go Continue use the bathroom right there, right? Miles. He's like, well, I have to piss really bad. So, well, I'm sure you could have made it into that building. I am pretty sure about that, but hey, that's how it goes with some people, right? I just finished having me a bite to eat, and guess what rolled up here? Let me show you guys, if I can. Yeah, look at that. I know it's raining a little bit, so I don't really want to stick my camera out there too much, but uh, yeah, that's an interesting, uh, interesting Volvo truck right there, that's for sure. But anyways, we just finished having our... Uh, bite to eat and all that good stuff so we're gonna go ahead and start the truck back up put the camera away and we gotta go just got across the border ladies and gentlemen yeah I'm happy about that however it is really really windy out here and the first little stretch here is usually pretty bumpy too so <laughs> anyways we got 135 it's kilometers to go Till we on. will be North at the South terminal Highway, in Winnipeg, and then we'll just go morning. home from there. No, it's a hundred kilometers an hour already, RJ. I don't know what you're smoking. Continue on this road. Well, yeah. 15 kilometers. It is other than that. It is a pretty good day. It is not too super warm, but it's not really supposed to be too super warm this week either from the looks of things but except for Friday I think it's supposed to be a pretty nice decent day on Friday scale was not open today so we're good to go we don't have to go in there today so let's go ahead and get into Winnipeg drop this trailer and go home and then what we got planned for tonight is uh, my buddy Ronnie had a birthday yesterday it was his birthday yesterday so uh, my buddy Walter wants to do a birthday surprise party for him. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to uh, have a birthday surprise party for him tonight. That's the plan anyways. Hey guys. Let's Happy check birthday. This. Let's check this out. Yeah. We're, we're over here at Walter's place. Hey yeah. everybody. Hey. <laughs> they're telling me that they're having a birthday <laughs> surprise party for me. Hey everybody! This is for Rudy and Ronnie both. So I had to put, I had to lie a little bit. So I have to tell tell you guys a little bit of sorry because I had to lie to Rudy and Ronnie. So I invited Ronnie. Told Ronnie it's Rudy's birthday, and I invite and uh, and I invited Rudy for Ronnie's birthday. So <laughs> both they got here now. Yeah, yeah. So here we are. We're barbecuing, of course, right? What do you got to say, Mr. Ronnie? You, uh, had, you had a good weekend? Oh, awesome weekend. Yeah? So, you want to tell everybody what we're doing here? I don't know what I have to do here. You don't, <laughs> you don't know what you have to do no. here? Oh, boy. Well, guys, I don't know if you are ready for it, but look at the oh, juice. My. Look at the juice. Yeah, I see that. That is, it is for your birthday, Rudy okay. and Ronnie. Both of you. Sorry for lying, guys. But... It is worth it. He, he's not sorry, is he? No. Well, I'm it's at organic. least at least I am playing it that way. Yeah, pretending, right? Yeah. Pretending, <laughs> pretending friends. <laughs> but the good thing is, as long as I pretend, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, uh -huh. as long as you don't tell uh, tell anybody that, look at this, Rudy. Oh, I know. Tell me. For for it. your birthday, like what the heck? Uh huh. That oh, nice know, piece of it. fat on there. Oh, that looks amazing. So we will taste it. That well, is. my buddy, uh, my buddy Tommy, 
he said he likes that if Walter puts a big meat on the on the fork, and then he says uh, he says he's gonna make a bet with me who's gonna come here first, him or Jukebox. Okay, Tommy, this is for you. Yeah. See, I will. That's right here. Uh huh. Okay. Now, Tommy, <laughs> this is for you. <laughs> There you oh. go, Tom. You know who you are from Florida, mister. Yep. So, I want to see who's going to be here first. Mm -hmm. Rudy, that is for Tom. Oh, hey, everybody. Let, let, let's check this this guy out here. Yeah, look at that, guys. Ooh. Mmm. Mmm. <clears throat> oh, That's yeah. a good piece of meat right there. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm telling you guys. Well, I, I'm wondering. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm going to see who's going to be the first one here. If Jukebox or Tom. Yeah, we definitely want to see that. Tom, I'll save this one rib here for you. This <laughs> middle one here. Look at that nice piece of fat oh, on there. Oh, that looks nice. I'll save that for you. <laughs> how, long anyway. do I, how long do I have to save it? Save, I don't know, you know, like... Who knows? Depends, right? Well, that is exactly. Mm-hmm. Right, we're having a good evening here. So we'll go ahead and have supper here in a minute. Hey, Ronnie. You had a good weekend, yeah? Oh, awesome. <laughs> How about you? Oh, it was pretty good. It was pretty good. You're still driving? Oh, not any real. Uh, not right now, no. <laughs> I, I had I had a few, a few of these, so we can't be doing any driving. <laughs> yeah, and you? Getting ready to have some good supper? I think so. Yeah? yeah? Let's show everybody what we're having over here. Look. Look at that, eh? Oh my That's goodness. Some meat. There's some meat, some good uh, onions, some vegetables. Oh, Ronnie what, is throwing. That was the empty bottle anyway, yeah, so okay. nobody cares about that one, right? Yeah, That's right. It's long time I see you, man. No, I know. You yeah. never have time anymore. Oh, I think it's the opposite. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's Mr. Ronnie has no time, eh? What? Ronnie's going away. That's why he has no time. He doesn't want to spend time with you. Oh, I know. He's he's good buddy with Walter. No, he doesn't want to spend time with me. <laughs> oh, my goodness. What do you yeah. got there, Mr. Walter? Well, we have some... Hard bread? Yes. Galletas. de Paraguay. Yeah, from Paraguay. that's right. That's what we have. All right. We're going to have good supper here in a minute. I'm telling you guys. So, now we are ready to eat. But before we go to eat, what are we going to do? We're going to sing a happy birthday. <laughs> All right. Let's happy sing birthday. for happy both birthday. of these boys. Let's yeah. sing happy birthday. These are happy big man. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to me and Rory. Yeah, that's happy right. Happy birthday, birthday to you. So this is the, their birthday. Rudy had it in the truck. But yeah. now we're going to have it. Now we're going to have a beautiful no. supper. No cake? Huh? There's oh, cake. that is coming later, guys. It's that we there. will show you later. <laughs> that is one thing. You have to wait for a little bit. Ooh, that's right. Oh, I know. You have to wait for the cake for Rudy because <laughs> that's he only he, for me, right? No, 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 no. <laughs> Ronnie has half of it, and you have half of it. Yeah, yeah. Ronnie gets quarter, right? <laughs> no. We'll, we'll discuss that later. We'll discuss but that we'll later. have a supper, guys. <laughs> All righty, guys. We had us an awesome supper. Hi. We can't finish the day without Jessica in here, right? Yeah. You wanted to be in here too, eh? Oh, I know. You said, hey, let me get in here too, eh? Oh, I know. You love being on camera, eh? You said you miss Daddy, huh? You miss Daddy? Oh, yeah, eh? You're having a lot of fun here tonight, aren't you? Huh? Let's go check out what they have over there, eh? Yeah. <laughs> looks, looks like they got some, uh, some cake over here. Yeah, let's see what we got here. Look at that, it says happy birthday. Doesn't say to who, but it says happy birthday. Oh, but I can put it on there, Rudy, don't worry. Oh, you can put it and on there? And then 
a very good cake with a coffee, yeah, you got it's a coffee. gonna be so good. Yeah, what do you think there, Mr. Ron? Well, yeah, I didn't mess any names here. I don't know what's going on here. Yeah. Well, Rudy, maybe this yeah. is for Tom. See, I told Tom I would uh, keep this for him, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. What do you say, Ronnie? Uh, they're missing the names. Oh, I well, know, that's right? okay. Maybe next time, right? Yeah, next time. Yeah. Well, but the names, I can put them in there if yeah. you want. Yeah, I, I can put the names in there. <laughs> yeah? So, yeah. Oh, I'm not going to tell you everything because then the people, they want to know right away. So I, I want to keep some secrets. <laughs> yeah, I think that's going to, I think I'm going to take a picture of that too, so. Let me get a yeah. good picture. We have made it home, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, I got something in the mail yesterday that I didn't get a chance to test yet while I was uh, <clears throat> getting ready to go to uh, Walter's place, right? So I wanted to kind of see what that is. Can you guys spot it, what it is? I'm sure you guys can. Let me just try this and see if you guys can still hear me good. You guys remember when I turned around my uh, my camera, you wouldn't be able to hear me very good, right? Yeah, this is basically just our backyard and I know we need to get to cutting that stuff. And you guys remember right there on the edge, there was a, uh, or there is a robin's nest. And at least we believe it's a robin's. And uh, I just went and checked on it. And it looks like they are uh, they are definitely breeding in there. They got two eggs in there right now, so I don't want to disturb it, right? He wasn't sitting on there, but, uh, or she, and, uh, but yeah, so I figured uh, I'll leave him alone, right? <laughs> but if you can spot it, guys, it is this thing right here. Yeah, wife is over there looking at me. So yeah, I'm going to test it a little bit, and if you know what it is, you guys probably uh, probably do. It's a wireless mic, and it's got a little foamy thing on it and everything. So, figured I'd get out here. It's not really super super windy, but I want to see what it sounds like. Right? That's my main purpose of doing this test, and uh, I charged it up overnight. So now uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna like this because then I can get out and walk around and set the camera up somewhere and. Uh, I don't have to worry about having crappy audio, right? Because I'm gonna have this thing clipped to my, my shirt and I can walk, I think they said up to about 60 meters. And uh, so that's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna really, really like that. <laughs> oh, that's a little dark right there, but I hear some sort of bird up here. Let's see if we can spot them. Usually when the, gr when the trees are so green, it's almost darn near impossible to spot them. Yeah. I can't see him just yet. <laughs> Let's see. I think he's sitting over there somewhere. Pretty sure he is. Oh no, there's a couple of ones. Right there. No, no they're flying away. Oh, well. anyways. We got the, uh, we still got the bird feeder up there. As you guys can see. And uh, yeah, we uh, put new, uh, feet in it and they're really starting to come back and liking it so but i'm hoping this mic will sound really good i'm going to take it back inside and uh, we'll listen to it and see what it sounds like right i might you know if if i really like it especially when i'm driving down the road i can easily clip this onto my seat belt you know even in a car right and it'd be nice and you guys are going to be able to hear me really nicely shouldn't have to talk too loud or whatever right that's kind of the goal. So let's go back inside. And uh, I guess what I'm gonna do is call it a day. I uh, wanna see how the echoing and all of that is too, right? So with that being said, we're gonna go ahead and get out of here, guys. Appreciate you guys watching. And we'll, back, we'll be back tomorrow. So thank you very much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.